Let's discuss the difference between traditional cost management and strategic cost management. Traditional cost management is about short-term outlook while strategic cost management is about long-term. Traditional cost management focuses on cost reduction for temporary period, ignoring long-term growth. While strategic cost management focuses on long-term value creation for all the stakeholders. Traditional cost management focuses only on internal factors ignoring external factors like market growth, competition, and customer requirements. While strategic cost management focuses on both internal as well as external. Before understanding the difference, we need to understand the cost driver. Cost driver is the direct cause of a cost and its effect on the total cost incurred. For example, area occupied can be the cost driver for rent expenses. Now, in the traditional cost management system, cost driver is based on volume of the product. While in the strategic cost management, each value activity has a separate cost driver. For detailed understanding of the cost driver concept, refer video part 8 of this chapter. Objectives of the traditional cost management include scorekeeping, attention directing and problem solving. Now let's understand these three terminologies. Scorekeeping means accounting of each transaction or event by internal as well as external parties that means kind of keeping records. While attention directing means prepare reports for management which needs to be focused due to its operating problems or inefficiencies. And problem solving means identifying problems and recommend the best alternatives. Thus, traditional cost management focuses on keeping records, focus on significant problems and provide solution for the same by scorekeeping, attention directing and problem solving respectively. While, objective of strategic cost management is cost leadership and product differentiation. Cost leadership means lowering the cost of material, labor or other services to earn higher profits or to charge lesser price than the competitors to penetrate the market without affecting the quality. And product differentiation that means superior innovation or superior quality or superior customer responsiveness. Video part 14 and part 15 of this chapter would cover detailed explanations of product differentiation and cost leadership. Understood? Cost reduction is the primary objective of the traditional cost management. While in the strategic cost management's primary objective is the cost containment along with cost reduction and value improvement. Cost reduction means to find some lower cost alternative instead of eliminating any activity. While the cost containment means the business practice of maintaining expense levels to prevent unnecessary spending or thoughtfully reducing expenses to improve profitability without affecting long-term growth. This concept is broader and more helpful in today's environment. Approach of the traditional cost management is risk averse that means not to take risks to avoid loss over making gain. While the approach of strategic cost management is risk-taking and ability to adapt itself with changing environment. Nowadays, famous dialogue from web series Scam 1992, Risk Hetu Ishk is very true in the today's environment. One has to take risk with thinking about environment and other related factors to get the benefits and to do something different. Got it? Thanks for watching it. Hey guys, hope you have learned from this video. So please like and share the video, comment if you have any doubt or a suggestion and don't forget to subscribe the channel. Keep watching, keep learning. In short, it is quick. Thank you.